So I'm a, a cognitive and stroke neurologist uh, in the Department of Medicine at uh, Sunnybrook. I uh, see patients uh, with uh, stroke and dementia as my primary clinical activity. I also have various administrative roles. I'm the Brain Sciences Research Director and Site Director of the Heart and Stroke Foundation Center for Stroke Recovery. Um, I also recently was appointed as the Executive Director of the Toronto Dementia Research Alliance which is a collaborative uh, across all of the academic institutions with memory programs in Toronto. Um, I specialize in uh, seeing patients with cognitive disorders, that is, where they have memory problems, they have trouble talking, they have trouble uh, finding their way around. Um, I also see patients who've had uh, problems with cognition after stroke, and uh, that is what uh, I do on a, a, a regular basis. Um, however, I also work in a multidisciplinary team with uh, psychiatry, uh, neurosurgery, um, neuropsychology to help take care of these patients. So I focus uh, particularly on research. I'm a clinician scientist. Uh, I focus on research in uh, stroke and dementia using neuroimaging analysis tools to help in diagnosis and understand um, how we can better monitor and treat patients uh, with these diseases. I'm an active clinical trialist. Uh, I've done uh, many uh, research studies uh, trying to discover new treatments for stroke and dementia, over 50, I'm afraid, in uh, my years at Sunnybrook. Um, and um, I also uh, am uh, very um, actively involved in mentoring young scientists and trying to um, help them grow up to be the researchers of tomorrow. Well, this um, area is really becoming quite hot. Uh, the ability to see networks in the brain in action, to understand um, how the brain is uh, shrinking in very specific ways over time and differently in different uh, disease states, um, to understand how people recover from a stroke even though a large area of the brain has been injured, um, and how we might be able to use novel techniques to improve that. The area I work in is so frontier and fascinating. We don't have answers to how, how to help make the brain recover or to prevent decline from, say, Alzheimer's disease. But I guess what I enjoy the most is that my research is embedded in care. I have the privilege of taking care of uh, families and patients with these disorders. I learn from them every day. I try to bring the research that I do back to them so that they can benefit, if not in uh, new uh, treatments, which sometimes uh, does result from our clinical uh, trials activities, but just so that they can understand uh, what they're facing and how we can help them uh, go through the process in a more constructive fashion. I think what I like most and actually love about working at Sunnybrook <clears throat> is the collegial environment and the multidisciplinary approach to everything. So um, we actually walk the talk of uh, teams with different expertise. We have basic science, we have psychiatry, neuro neuropsychology, neurosurgery. <clears throat> we all are um, working together in, in ways that I think produce novel results because we have the benefit of expert uh, opinion from uh, different areas. And um, I think uh, that's one of the most attractive as aspects of Sunnybrook.